Now, just a minute, Dr. Brooks. Didn't Jesus tell the thief on the cross he would go that day into paradise? Oh, well, now, we've had, we've had people say that. We told you the other night, we read to you that David was not in heaven. Acts 2, 29 and 34, you remember that? If you do, say amen, you can talk to me. And, and we indicated that the saints sleep in their graves and wait on the coming of our Lord. The Bible says they'll rise first, then the rest of us who might live until that time will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And so someone says, didn't Jesus tell the thief on the cross he would be with him that day in paradise? The answer to your question is a resounding no. He did not tell him that. Now I'm sure some say, but wait a minute, I read it. Well, let me put it this way. I have an illustration I'd like to use. A man who owned a large company sent one of his representatives to Europe to buy material. When the man got over there, the things cost a lot more than they expected. So he sent his boss a telegram and said, these are the prices, should I buy? The boss wired him back and he bought a lot of things, brought them back to America and was called in on the carpet. The boss said, why in the world did you waste our money like that? He said, well, I sent you a wire and asked you if I should buy. I got the wire right here. It said, no price too high. His boss said, let me see that. That's not what I said. I said, no, price too high. <laughs> so the problem was one of punctuation. <laughs> I'm going to read it twice and I want you to listen. Jesus said, Verily I say unto thee, Today shalt thou be with me in paradise. That's the way it's read. The way it should read in the Greek is, I'm telling you today, comma, thou shalt be with me in paradise. Oh, but you say it's easy for you to say that. How can you prove it? I'll prove it with a familiar Easter story. Jesus went into the tomb and stayed until Sunday morning. And a lady by the name of Mary was there near the tomb weeping when she heard someone call her name. And when she answered, she thought he was the gardener. But when he spoke to her again, she knew him and she reached for him, wouldn't you? Now, how many remember this? Jesus said, touch me not for I have not yet ascended to my father. Have you heard that? If you have, say amen. amen. You'll, find it in, you'll find it in John 20 and 17, and you'll find the other in Luke 23, 43. Jesus wasn't even in heaven Friday. So how could the thief be with him in paradise when he didn't go till Sunday? 